Whoa, a new girl at school. Do you realize what destiny has brought you today? Yours truly, Hector Hulk Sanchez. How did you know I was new here? Hulk? Back off, Nancy. I'm not into pushy girls. Do me a favor. Bother someone else. I've told you what I know. Listen, my body's my temple. I can't risk it for anyone. Hey, I'm with you, but I can't get involved. There's no way I'm risking my football career. How's it going? Hey, you're talking to the man, the number one football player in the state of Florida. I know all the beautiful girls at Paseo Del Mar High. Are you kidding? You are new around here. I play for the Manatees, one of the best teams in the state. I leave the others in the dirt, man. Soon it's college ball, and then the Miami Dolphins. Showtime! Isn't it obvious? I'm tall, dark, handsome, not to mention a superstar athlete. Everybody knows Hulk Sanchez and the Hulk knows everybody. Paseo Del Mar's mascot is a manatee. Don't tell me you're afraid of a little Seco. Haven't you been reading the papers? Paseo Del Mar High School has been Florida's number one football team for the last four years. Is there anything else I can enlighten you on? Yeah, I'm playing great football this year. I'm expecting an offer from a Big Ten school any day now. I knew Jake, but I didn't hang out with him. Sorry, can't talk now. I gotta go to practice. Later. Yeah, just sneeze and it'll swim away. Seriously, the Manatees are a great team at a great school. Everyone is cool. Except for a few punks like Jake Rogers. <laughs> You're not from Florida, are you? There's nothing to be afraid of. Manatees are the friendliest underwater sea cows around. I've been trying to get the coach to change that lame mascot ever since I first made the team. Hulk, is there anything you fear? Listen, sweetheart, to be the best, you gotta be aggressive and show them who's boss. Like the guy who killed Jake. Somebody killed Jake Rogers. There's no way I'm not gonna play college ball. Unlike Jake Rogers, I'm a winner. Football! I'm destined to become a college star and then turn pro. Then, when I'm famous, jerks like Jake Rogers will eat my socks for breakfast. I'm afraid you're asking too many questions. What's it to you? Me? When I walk down the halls, it's punks like Jake Rogers who fear me. You have to be aggressive to survive in this world. Jake just couldn't cut it, that's all. I like winning if that's what you mean. I do my job out there on the field. My opponents are supposed to fear me. I'm sorry Jake's dead, but I can't waste my time worrying about it. Jake Rogers was a loser. No one liked the dude. Even if he'd lived, he was headed for trouble. Why should it? I have a big future ahead of me. That's all that concerns me. My only enemies are on the field. Off the field, I'm a pussycat. You have to be aggressive if you want to win. That's why I'm the best. She hangs out at the gym a lot. I heard she's been having a real tough time. That dude is always studying. He's a huge fan of mine. Real smart guy. But I never understood why a brain like Tanaka would hang out with slime like Jake Rogers. Where'd you hear that? I'm as strong as ever. He seems like a cool guy. His family used to sponsor the annual football awards dinner until last year. You know, he's the one who found Jake's body. I could tear the door off with my teeth. But it might be easier to just ask Hal Tanaka. His locker was right next to Jake's. I didn't pay much attention to Jake. I'm tired of talking about that loser. Why would I know about a robbery? All I know about is football. Yeah, he found out I stole the steroids and threatened to turn me over to the cops. Would have meant the end of my football career if I didn't cooperate. Sorry, babe. I can't risk getting involved. I don't know. She's a pretty good athlete, but never joined any of Paseo Del Mar's teams. I heard she's been having a cash flow problem. Hmm. Not exactly sure. Tanaka never missed a game. That is... Until he started hanging out with Jake. Let's just say I saw them talking together a lot. Jake's locker was right next to Hal's. Now that I think of it, last time I saw them together, Hal seemed pretty upset. You name it. Chauffeur, errand boy, bodyguard. He loved ordering me around like I was his slave. I got hurt really bad in a game a few weeks back. Broke four ribs and cracked two others. I had to keep playing even though I was hurt. Needed to impress the scouts. And then I started taking steroids wasn't worth it because I was still in pain and all my free time was spent playing errand boy for Jake. The last thing Jake had me do was deliver a note to Daryl Gray. It was in a sealed envelope so I couldn't read it. My bet is Jake was blackmailing Daryl too. I'm not a killer, Nancy. I didn't do it. I'm out of here. I'll catch you later, beautiful. Bye, Nancy. Later, sweetheart. What can you tell me about Connie Watson? Do you know Hal Tanaka? I'm really sorry you got injured. 
Does that affect your chances of playing college ball? What can you tell me about Daryl Gray? How could I get into Jake's locker? Do you know why Jake had a video camera in his locker? Tell me about the robbery at the drug depot pharmacy. Jake knew you broke into the drug depot. He was blackmailing you, wasn't he? Hulk, we're going to find the person who killed Jake. If you help out now, this case will move a lot quicker.